وسيم وش راك؟ صافا الحمد لله اي توا صافا لا باس الحمد لله استمتعت كي كنت نسمع فيك ميرسي بوكو جو سوي سور كو الناس اللي سمعوك استمتعوا بزاف ميرسي وسيم اي هوب سو كيفاش كيفاش باش لحقت الجيتاره كيفاش ديسيديت بلي تاعي تاع جيتاره ماشي تاع بيانو ماشي تاع داكور جيت تاع ساكسوفون ويل تو بي To be very honest with you, it's not something uh, necessarily special. Shall I say? I was here in a way. Shall it kind of was? Because uh, generally, people go to an instrument if they ever go to an instrument. They go to an instrument. Uh, shall depending on the music they listen to. Okay. Hamtani. Donc, Anna. For example, I was listening to a lot of rock. As you know, we were listening to a lot of rock at the time. Mm-hmm. Uh, we've listened to a lot of styles uh, when we were kids. Such old rock, we were all very, very uh, fond of. Tu vois? Mm. Donc, uh, we were listening to Guns N' Roses, Pearl Jam, Ozzy Osbourne, and shit. And obviously, you can't say bad. You can say shit. Yeah. Okay. Okay. <laughs> That's the limit. Anyway, so so of course, uh, when you listen to guitar, you're gonna want to play guitar. Tu vois? Mm. That's almost inevitable. Yeah. So so yeah, that's basically how it works. Uh, if you want to learn, uh, if you don't want to know exactly all the details uh, of, uh, I was basically studying. Could you say I was like 12 or 11, and then uh, and then I heard uh, She was in another class. If you want to do and do the course of in plus enough blida, if you want to know, if you want to come with us and uh, play. And yeah, Qalta was like, yeah, why not? Uh, the only thing I'm doing here is playing video games and uh, barely studying, so why, uh, why shouldn't I not uh, uh, do it? So I my père, as you know, once again, and, uh, and he bought me a guitar, and uh, I started there. I didn't learn much there. But uh, yeah, you started with a very simple acoustic guitar. I started with uh, a ac- uh, classical uh, guitar, mm-hmm. yes, uh, because the place we could labo was uh, oriented uh, towards classical music mainly. Mm. So and very much oriented into classical music. Because when I was playing the stuff that I loved, which was rock, mm-hmm. they told me to stop and to focus on what they were giving me, which yeah. I didn't do. Tu vois? Okay. And almost gladly. Tu vois? Mm. So yeah.
me about the influence of video games. Uh, well, I'm sure video games, like, I'm sure. I know video <laughs> games, but like, homely, they kind of educated you when it comes to... When music. it comes to music? And, uh, and playing guitar, like... Well, when like, okay, look, this is something cool. For sure, for sure. I think uh, games like GTA San Andreas uh, teach us a lot about uh, culture and uh, and uh, the rock music. You were listening to Radio X and KDST. Mm. It with was the, very much with filled Axel Rose. Uh, with Axel Rose as <laughs> the uh, in, uh, the guy who was uh, yeah. Uh, leading. Yeah, it was. Uh, we will learn a lot of uh, shall the, the most important classical uh, yeah, rock songs. music mm. songs can ultima in those two channels. Yeah. So obviously, shall and I'm sure I'm not the only one. Even though I'm a one any kind of style, nurelu nurelu nsmalo hold the line that Toto or or that David Bowie. I forgot the song. They're going to recognize it. Uh, very yeah. <laughs> That's another story. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Hero, which uh, yeah, yeah, I was gonna mention absolutely, that. yeah, uh, because I remember Rabbil Machiri Guitar could basically could have guitar on guitar, guitar here using the keyboard. Uh, yes, I was, I was basically can on the keyboard and basically could nerf it and uh, I of course binded the keys you can mm -hmm. to resemble the keys to, uh, of the buttons that a, a guitar hero guitar, a fake yes. guitar, uh, mm -hmm. basically, jouer. And uh, it was a lot of fun, let me tell you. Mm -hmm. It was, yeah, I shredded a lot better. And yeah. of course, that very much me, uh, led me to, to, to play guitar. So that inspired me a lot, mm -hmm. obviously. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Tell me about the musicians that inspired you. The musicians that inspired me... Uh, that are inspiring yeah. you right now. Yeah. Right now. Well, yeah. I can tell you about the, the ones who inspired me before, because they're very important okay. before uh, coming to Leiba Tadoka. Uh, which the main one was Slash, Tag uh, and Roses, uh, Mike, <laughs> uh, Mike McCready, uh, Pearl Jam. Yeah, that, those those two guys really. Because I was one of the people they can use basically two bands, or three. Uh, Zach Wilde. Well, I was I was very much into heavy metal, uh, heavy uh, rock. Actually, yeah. hard rock basically. It's, it's, it's not heavy rock. Huh? It's not heavy. Yeah, it's hard rock. Guns N' Roses is hard rock. Yeah. Uh, Pearl Jam wasn't hard rock, but it was filled with the. Uh, the first album was hard rock. Uh, Tamen. Per jump, per yeah, they had. Hijab. Well, people call it grunge. Uh, grunge is uh, music that comes from Seattle. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. Not, it's right. They come genre. from Seattle. Indeed, it's not a genre. It's not uh, a type of music because when you compare Pearl Jam and Nirvana, Nirvana or the Arctic Arctic Monkeys, yes, they not, they really don't alive. fit in yes. the into the category. Yeah, yeah. absolutely. But uh, yeah, and uh, that was the style I was I was listening to. So the people who were uh, and I was uh, mainly oriented into solos, and I still am. Well, mm. My uh, my main focus point and my main uh, shall uh, uh, shall uh, my my strongest point is basically soloing more than any other thing. So I'm trying to blend into and um, blend other stuff in it. But, uh, it's mainly liquid I I'm into mm. solos because of Slash. And because of Mike McCready, because of Zach Wild, um, Doka, we're talking, we're talking bomb. When I say Doka, I'm talking like uh, since Khamsa uh, Snein, tu vois, depuis 2015, 2016, enfin 2015, I got interest, uh, introduced into, uh, to, to Guthrie Govan. I don't know if you know him, probably don't. I've heard him a few times. Okay, yeah. Yeah. Uh, the guy is, uh, is insane. The guy is it's, he's not normal, tu vois. Yeah. Everybody who knows him knows that. Uh, he's mad, uh, he's mad. I, I remember the first song to was uh, Fives. Uh, Smata of YouTube, mm -hmm. and uh, it blew me away. It blew me away. So I was like, yeah, I gotta, I gotta learn how to play this. Because, you know, as, 
as uh, someone who loves something مش necessarily as a musician ولا ما مي دا سبور ولا a lot of people تشوفهم زعما يحبوا الفوتبول يشوفوا كريستيانو رونالدو if they watch it a lot and they love it and it, they want to do it تشوف yeah. it's it's almost hum- it's hum- it's human nature so basically that's exactly what happened to me شغل كنت نسمع غاثري جوفن نسمع ستيف فايتاني was introduced there Uh, Joe Satriani and stuff. Kima Steve by Bena. The main song was uh, for the love of uh, for the love of God. This mm. matter, I had to play it, and I had to uh, automatically learn the skills. Which not done the you know. And yeah, that's when you. Every time, one hadith is saying, "How can I play uh, like this? How can I achieve this sound? How can I uh, do this?" Uh, it's not no, I can give you advice but it's not going to do much so it's going to help you the main thing is play what you love actually play what you're listening to don't try to do something that you don't like because it's not you're not going to keep up you're not going to be able to because in hardly the moments when it's hard uh, I'm just going to put down the guitar and I'm not going to look, look at it again you mm. basically Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm uh, one of those guys. I wanna, I wanna play instruments, etc. Mm. But I'm, uh, it's too hard. I don't have the patience. Or uh, uh, do you not have the patience? Will, uh, will, uh, do you not have the time? Oh, but I, I went through, uh, I went through confinement, yeah, and I had a lot of time. So you had a lot of time. Uh, I had yeah. a lot of time, and uh, I couldn't. Yeah, but in the same time, in the same time, I had a guitar at the back, because I'm a gaucher. No, no. Uh, okay. Even uh, we have the synthesizer in the back. <laughs> and uh, it's a perfect instrument yeah and yet, you can uh, you don't have any excuse there yes, yeah yes uh yeah uh, tell me about your uh, your uh, career and your experiences playing guitar uh my car- my career so uh, where i learned uh, music mainly was at home so my mm-hmm. uh, my whole experience my biggest side to a city playing at home mm-hmm. so for instance, so in my career is getting bigger and bigger I haven't played too many concerts because people who can call you. you have played enough concerts. Enough to, to do what? It depends. Enough to have played concerts. <laughs> yani, yani there's a huge difference between Absolutely. someone yeah. who hasn't played uh, concerts and someone Before. who has played five concerts. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah. How many yeah. concerts did you do? I, I don't. I can't count them. Maybe I like think, uh, oh, more, more than five for sure. More than five. <laughs> yeah, yeah, for sure. Yeah, for sure. For sure. No, and I don't. And I'm not counting the ones that I haven't been paid for. Tu vois? You I'm should. Not, yeah, you should. Ma- ma- I should of course, because mm-hmm. it's experience. It's added experience. As the people who try to hire you to do it for free mm-hmm. tell you, tu vois? Oh, do it for experience. Do it for uh, for mm-hmm. actually. If, Uh, صحة, yeah, and uh, generally, shall, uh, I value the ones when I've been paid, not be necessarily because of the money, but because you feel like you ha- you, you did something shall, uh, that had value. You know, maybe you played a game like shall have made some money or no offense. You know, yeah, yeah. Uh, but, but tell me, tell me uh, more about uh, those experiences. Yeah, like you played for Bas Bosfor, you played in uh, other places. Bosphore, c'est, for, uh, Bosphore, c'est un bar, basically, in mm. Alger, mm. uh, when people play. Uh, a, lot, a lot of great musicians play. A lot of great musicians to make. It's incredible Insane. music. Bon, not a lot, but uh, basically the whole musical uh, community, uh, community yeah, yeah, high-level yeah. musical community, it is concentrated, basically. Mm, mm. Yeah. Yes, so you played there. I've got some photos uh, on Instagram. Tell yeah. Me. Yeah. And uh, the ambiance to make it was It's amazing. insane. It's insane. Yeah. And everyone every musician experienced super experienced musician there tells me Billy it's it's uh, it only happens for Bosphor. That kind of uh, vibe Makesh for Bosphor. Uh, Makesh yeah. Aya. Yeah. Donc uh, donc when you uh, they have played uh, rock uh, music elsewhere people don't care. Tu vois, so yes. people don't care. And I have played any elsewhere. Uh, I have played in restaurants, I have played the uh, Ma, people don't. So they don't. A lot uh, of uh, a lot of um, foreigners they go to the Bosphor as well. Yeah. So yeah. this is one thing. So foreigners usually, so com- compared mm. to Algerians, you mm. know what I mean. Ah, so not the uh, ana, live m- music. Most people there were not foreigners. Actually, most people weren't foreigners. But so those were people who really appreciated music. So yeah. Probably exactly. they chose Bosphor exactly. because of the, uh, of the music. feature. Ta- yeah. You go there and yeah, you listen to music, live music. Yeah, absolutely. But unfortunately, Bosphor is good. Since we're 
Well, it was too much noise. No, uh, too much noise. They I were, think, they were I think its owner uh, had uh, legal problems. Exactly. Yes, uh, he, so he they was caught in a, in a fight, I heard. Ah bon? <laughs> yes. Where did you hear that? Hear that from? <laughs> what? Probably. I'm not sure it's manslaughter, but um, yeah. So it's what did you say? They Yeah. Uh, alcohol. You had some inside information. Yeah, yeah. alcohol. That's... Mm. Yeah. Mm. Uh, so... Uh, Uh, the thing that happens in Nakhish via the Bosphor, especially Bosphor, and not only Bosphor, there, there was this place in Sismaha, Jayak Damriyad al Fetha. You do remember it? I, play, I played there. You, you played there, yes. We can gain saxophonist Hadak. Don't remember. You know, uh, <laughs> you know. <laughs> It's insane, my chef. Well, Riyad al Fetha, Gaba Hagdat Riyad al Fetha. Ah, yeah, I remember. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yes, that yeah. was also I played a concert there. Yeah. One of the best lives I have ever seen. Yeah. Uh, uh, all the musicians there were extremely good. Like uh, it, extremely it wasn't like Bosfar. It wasn't, uh, it was it basically was one band. Yeah. And it was one band. It was one and band. And there were, there were some guest appearances that different musicians. Sometimes, I yeah. Think, that's I think the beautiful was, thing. Uh, I, I think there was some guy, Lee, who wasn't going to play the saxophonist. Sax- yeah. And he ended up playing. Yeah. And it I was think he works of, there. Yes. Uh, and yeah, he's a super nice guy. Yes. Uh, yes. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Uh, uh, Incredible. Uh, and we played the uh, CV Wonder. We played uh, mm-hmm. yes, played a yes. few songs. Yes, incredible solo that he did. Yeah. Um, uh, and um, about uh, Bosfar, uh, I was uh, there, so I, w- I I came to to watch you play, etc. Mm-hmm. And then, uh, they would play reggae and they would play other types of music. Yeah, they weren't one just focused the, on yes, uh, one, of, uh, one style. One of the types of music that is. Uh, Ironically, kind uh, of less popular for uh, mm-hmm. which is right. <laughs> well, it's it not is very popular, but when yeah. it comes to cool music, <laughs> lately it's not popular anymore. <laughs> but uh, it is still popular. What are you talking about? No, no, no. When it comes to cool music, so it's pop. Uh, yeah, uh, cool. Mu- so that's I don't know to them to the people who listen to Rai. And uh, bon, I, I right. listen to Rai sometimes, though, mm-hmm. uh, and uh, and I'm absolutely proud of it. It's part of our culture. Well, uh, I listen uh, to uh, Rai. Of course, she she Of course, mm. can call example. I listen to pop. Can a lot of uh, pop mm. music that I cannot listen to. Actually, if it's kima mm. kima uh, music Actually, if you listen to it, you listen to it. Taus haba kitkuna hinel par once or twice, and then it's dead. And you never hear from it again. Actually, if and uh, if if you listen to it again, it's too much. It's it's bad. So yeah. It's not made. Because if you have basically, if I can get into the theory, if you have a chord progression that everybody uses, mm. so and it, it's yeah. easy to a- appreciate at first, but it's also easy to completely uh, yeah. get fed up with it. Yes. Yeah. Well, yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, I was saying, Billy, I uh, listened to Rai music there. Uh, mm. the, they were playing live yeah. Rai music. And I fully appreciated the right Mac. I really yeah. understood. Well, it was Wakal Labu Jihasni, Labu Shab Khalid, Labu Mani. Yes, and you cannot not appreciate. And, uh, it's it's yeah. incredible. Actually, it's incredible. The singers, the right Mac, they had mm. really beautiful voices. Yeah. And uh, and um, I don't know. Actually, I really Khasni Khasni Rai had a clue. See what I mean? So compared to. نسمع رايف طونو بيل هكذا مع صحابي باسكو ما يديرو ولا when you when you uh, when you are there watching uh, watching it live uh, concert mm. and uh, private concert مع تارك قدام uh, the band uh, it's uh, it's something that uh, really hits you <laughs> yeah so uh, we, let's talk about uh, your guitar this one yeah this one this the one. red one yeah yeah tell me about it and how did you get it Yeah, I, can, I knew, Billy, you were going to ask me this question <laughs> at some point. I was waiting for it. Well, it is an interesting story, uh, especially for some guy who lives in, uh, uh, yeah, especially for some guy who lives in Africa. Uh, well, uh, on 2015, 2014, 2015, mm-hmm. I started focusing a bit on posting on Facebook. Yes. You know, posting videos on Facebook. Mm-hmm. So I tried to, I wasn't doing crazy stuff. I was just, uh, shall improvising on uh, uh, as well as i knew yes. on the uh, backing tracks and shit backing tracks are basically just uh, to explain to the people are just basically instrumental music that are designed for you to play on top of them uh, yes. la guitar or la saxophone or la piano anything 
So I was using that and uh, I was posting regularly, inshallah, once a week. I wasn't making it a schedule or laps. It was fun for me. I liked the, the, the minimal amount of feedback mm. that I had. And uh, basically, I was posting a lot. So at some point, um, uh, one American guy, well, I was posting in the group, of course. Nobody would have seen it. So I was posting American groups and people from all, mm-hmm. all around the world were, uh, were uh, kind of had a clue group. So we're part of that uh, group. And uh, some of them shall really liked what I was doing. And one of them especially, shall he was k- shall, uh, c- commenting every time. He mm-hmm. ah, bravo, uh, enfin, in English, he was a great job. You did a, it was so good, my British. And he also, the, the, the important fact here is that he was a lefty, left-handed. Yes, yes. Voilà. Les gens, ils font la guitare généralement. Uh, haka, you know, le manche, il dit mm-hmm. And I was holding it, and I hold it minna, d'accord? Mm-hmm. So this is the difference, and the thing about it is that mm-hmm. when you're left-handed, 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 Yes, well, uh, the th- uh, thing about that is that uh, camera is not hard, shall, it's not complex when you use it, you know, it's just a button, so uh, I don't know, maybe you can tell it, me. Uh, I'm, sure, I'm sure it's not as complex as a guitar, I mean, like, I'm pretty sure about <laughs> it. Uh, <laughs> yeah, uh, uh, you yeah. should be. <laughs> However, mm. uh, when you are doing street photography, when you are doing some kinds of photography, Uh, stabilization, uh, light, uh, uh, low light photography. So, so you think it would it would be more convenient yeah, to bizarre, bizarre. Yeah, well, well, uh, for lefties, for a lefty to uh, to shoot with uh, his mm. right hand, mm. he's not going to be very accurate, and it's going to be very difficult for him to uh, frame uh, yeah. the photo uh, on uh, the dec- decisive moment. Hadak. Yeah, so I can. Yeah, fantastic, fantastic. I can give you an expl- a, a clear explanation why on why this they don't exist. Is that they really truly don't exist? Mm-hmm. Making shall shall basically it's clear that the left-handed people are shall a bit niche. Shall yes. m- yes. yeah. They're a small percentage compared to the mm-hmm. people who use the use it with the right. Had kain tani left-handed people mm-hmm. who learn to use it. No, kima gal kima. So, uh, they're not going to buy a left-handed camera if, they, if it ever existed. Mm-hmm. So, the production of cameras are going to have to put more money into pro- uh, producing uh, cameras that, that are going to sell. No, they're going to sell. They're not going to ah, sell. Voilà. They're not going to sell. Exactly. Mm-hmm. They're not mm-hmm. going to sell as much. Willa, they're going to take longer. Willa, it's just mm-hmm. an inconvenience to them. Mm-hmm. And it's more money. Sorry, it's the same the guitars. Yes. The guitars, all, it's less of a problem. Actually, Because it's niche anyway. It's niche anyway. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> it's very important as a left-handed player to play yes. uh, a left-handed guitar. So you can't, you cannot use it without uh, mm. it being uh, a left-handed guitar. Yes, you yes. Know? Continue the story. So where was I? Uh, yeah, so he was commenting uh, regularly on my, on my videos on, inside the group. And then at some point he added me on Facebook. Mm-hmm. And Kali, uh, she'll have a Facebook chat. Kali, vraiment, it's, it's so good. Because uh, he knew Billy, I was from Africa. Uh, he was surprised anyone could play uh, blues. Off, I played like trash. Mm. Uh, That's the spirit. Yes. You, st- you don't start being perfect. Exactly. Exactly. Mm. Uh, yeah, when I was in Africa, I was morale to be For someone who lives in Africa, it is pretty good. Yeah. It's pretty good, and it's it's uh, surprising to them. Mm-hmm. So so yeah, so he he liked it. Uh, Facebook it uh, He complimented me a lot too. And then at some point, uh, I posted another video. He commented. He was like, he commented them. Mm-hmm. Uh, which is funny. Do you need a uh, do you need a guitar? I was like. How am I supposed to answer that? Yeah, of course I need a guitar. Mm-hmm. I'll take anything. Yeah, I have a guitar. I have a spare guitar that I'm not using. I bought a while ago yeah. and I'm not using I have better guitars. So if you want to take it, if we could make that work, I'll mm-hmm. gladly give it to you. Yeah. I was like, dude. Yes. 
and uh, besides, I didn't believe it at uh, that point. Yeah, I didn't. You, you can't really believe yeah. it uh, because to you it's virtual. It's virtual. It's virtual. The fact that he's so far away, yeah, you yeah. the fact Hadi that he's going to give you a machine, he's going to mm. give you a guitar. And, and at that time, it wasn't Alibaba. You see a lot of shipments coming to Algeria. Mm. Uh, we didn't have that. Uh, we didn't have that option. We, even, we didn't know it existed. Even you today, you have a risk to Exactly. Exactly. Uh, and every Algerian you ask, "Trah lihat qalu." Ah, I can get it. You sell the clothes one. Do you know? That was the first thing they they uh, they said. So, I I told him, "I told you, they sell the clothes one." Oh, I told you, "Everything." I told him, "Sell the clothes one. It might be expensive. Everything." And it was indeed expensive. Can you see? I bought it for him. Yes. Can you see? I bought it directly to Algeria. It was a thousand dollars. It costed. Uh, it it was gonna cost him a thousand dollars. And yeah, he wasn't rich. He was an American. So he wasn't rich uh, mm. for an American. Ah, he was a very uh, middle class guy. Exactly. Exactly. He was a uh, 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 lower middle class. Exactly. A bit lower than that. I once sold a guitar that he really loved, especially and pay sale marto. So he wasn't rich. You know, just to know that he did hajat akhir. So he could have sold this guitar at a certain amount of money. He can get rich really easily. Do something and shit. So yeah, so uh, in the end, قلي مل دولا قلت أخلص. ما ما فيهاش. Well, it was uh, it was fun. So uh, at least I was gonna get a guitar. And then قلي قلي شو سك كين another alternative which so we can just send it. إذا عندك يون فامي في كاش بلاصة في فرنسا أو لا في لوروبا تو. Uh, we can send it there, but mm-hmm. it costs uh, $100 and it costs a hundred dollars, or two hundred dollars, which is um, which is some money. Actually, if yes. uh, like it costs uh, like double that, or yeah. oh, maybe a hundred dollars. Uh, it costs like at that time, I guess, six hundred or like that. So, see, the shall and I, my shock, shall he shift people who don't even know you, and you don't even play that well. So you're not necessarily uh, a god or like that. Care this much? Try, uh, are trying to, to do something this uh, mm. good to you? So um, uh, yeah, we try to make that work, and uh, I, I obviously have some family, very far family, Litema. So we did make it work, and it took a while, and and here it is. <laughs> yeah. yeah, and yeah, it yeah. sounds really good. It's really better than the, the. I have another one, which is a really good guitar. This is uh, this is just it sounds way better. Yeah. Mm. Is uh, is the guy we're talking about going to watch this podcast? Probably. I I may send it to him. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. yeah. We're, we're so mainly speaking in English, so I guess he'll understand. Yeah. yeah. Uh, he's going to understand 80 to yeah. 70%. So shout out to you. Thank you yeah. for his, his uh, name is uh, Chuck Franklin. Yeah. Hello Jack Franklin. <laughs> it's not Jack, it's Chuck. Chuck Charles. Ah, Chuck. Yeah. Hi ja- Chuck Fran- <laughs> Franklin. <laughs> I'm you just but I'm not gonna names. send him this podcast. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna send him this. Podcast. No, no, no. You better do. Yeah. Um, I think he's gonna laugh. Tell me, uh, very quickly. Tell me about uh, uh, your plans for the future. Are you planning any albums? Any yeah. Albums? Well, uh, right now it's uh, I'm mainly f- I'm gonna mainly focus on uh, Instagram because there's a lot of potential mm-hmm. there. Actually, if I want to have, uh, I don't want to make an album for. Nobody to listen to it. Actually, if I could do it, I need more experience. Meshif la guitar or lab. Yeah, you know what? Memf la guitar. I need more experience. Memf music. I need more experience with music production. Actually, if the logistics are hard and stuff, so now I would have. Kun kul yume I make music because it's fun. You know, maybe that nobody's gonna listen to it. I always make music. It's not. Packaged well, actually, if it's yes. not made into a neat, beautiful uh, package. Mm. So, in order for me to do that, listen, I I focus a bit more on the music production, uh, Logic Pro, FL Studio, and stuff, and uh, how it works, how mastering works, and and all. But uh, also getting an actual audience for for people to listen to it. I don't want to spend. I don't know how much time working on a song, but Zut's Habi Simoha, and uh, one of them liked it. Actually, <laughs> so yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, I see. So thank you very much, uh, Wesim, for uh, coming to the podcast. Thank you. Thanks a lot for the for the invite. Mm-hmm. I I'll, I'm sure I'll be coming again, and maybe we'll talk about something else. Yeah, yeah. any uh, coming? We're doing it in your home, so. 
Yeah, you're doing it uh, downstairs, so <laughs> I can just jump in. <laughs> anyway, it was a lot of fun uh, watching you play guitar. Uh, Thank as, you. As always. Thank you. I hope people are going to like it. Yes, mm. and uh, let me tell you that a lot of people are having really high hopes for uh, for you in the future, so you're going to... I know. You kinda, yeah. uh, you I'm not going to let them down. To Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. All right. Thank you for coming. And uh, by the way, I just wanna uh, I just wanna promote myself, Shreya. Bon, my uh, my Instagram is Wesim Rahmani Music. Okay, I changed it. I changed it. It was guitar. Now it's music. Uh, if you like my playing, if you like my uh, my guitar playing, my music uh, style, you can learn it. At some point, I'm gonna do online sessions. Utani, if you're in Blida or close to it, you can go to Crescendo School. He's I mean he's gonna put it for in the screen. Uh, and I'm teaching uh, guitar at uh, all, all the levels. If you're a uh, beginner, an absolute beginner, if you're, uh, if you're intermediate, it depends. If you're better than me, then don't come. <laughs> Tout simplement. Yeah. yeah, so yeah, uh, that's all I have to say. Thank you very all much. All right, all the links uh, are going to be in the description. Yes, exactly. Thank okay. you very much. See you next time. Inshallah, merci.